diesel fuel gels in cold weather, clogging fuel filters and causing time-consuming and expensive engine stallouts. Our inline fuel warmer will maximize uptime and keep your fleet running in cold weather. Gelling occurs when fuel reaches a low enough temperature where wax crystals form and prevents the flow of fuel. Wax is part of the chemical makeup of diesel and biodiesel fuels. The key is to keep diesel fuel at a temperature above the gel point. To make the issue more complex, the formation of wax varies from the different types of diesel fuels on the market. Depending on the chemical makeup, the refining process, and how the fuel is blended. The main types of diesel fuels on the market today are number one grade diesel, number two grade diesel, winterized, and biodiesel. Number one grade diesel fuel has a portion of the wax removed during the refining process and will gel at a much lower temperature than number two grade. Number two grade diesel fuel is the most common type of diesel fuel. It is less refined and therefore contains more wax and will gel at a higher temperature than number one grade. Winterized diesel fuel is a blend of number one and number two grade diesel fuels. Typically, 15 to 20% of the blend is number one grade diesel fuel. Winterized blends are released before the weather becomes too cold for number two diesel fuel. Biodiesel is a diesel fuel produced from organic materials through a refining process. Biodiesel is classified based on the percentage of its biodiesel content. For example, B5 has 5% biodiesel or B20 has 20% biodiesel. The greater the biodiesel percentage, the more susceptible it is to gelling in cold weather. Biodiesel is available throughout the United States. It is important to know what fuel type and grade you are using. Each blend will start to gel at different temperatures. Gelling becomes problematic when you're going from a warm to a cooler climate and don't have the proper fuel. The key factor to prevent fuel gelling is to maintain the temperature of the diesel fuel above the gel point. Install an inline fuel warmer that accommodates mobile or stationary equipment. It is thermostatically controlled for all weather operation and requires minimal maintenance. It is a proven and effective way to keep diesel fuel flowing by utilizing the warm engine coolant to raise the temperature of the diesel fuel. The inline fuel warmer circulates warm coolant from your engine's water pump, warming the cold fuel as it circulates through the inline warmer. The warming process continues if the engine's coolant is warmer than the fuel. The inline fuel warmer is installed before the primary fuel filter or transfer pump and prevents fuel gelling in the fuel line and filter. Heating the fuel closer to the fuel filter reduces the amount of heat loss from the surface of the fuel line. Advantages of an inline fuel warmer Prevents fuel from gelling in the fuel line and filter. Can be utilized prior to startup and during engine operation. No need to modify the fuel tank. Thermostatically controlled for all weather operation significantly reduces the amount of expensive fuel gelling additives and knowing when to add them to the fuel. Automated driver-friendly solution. Convenient aftermarket installation. Manufactured from 304 stainless steel for long service life. Minimal maintenance because there are no moving parts. Maximize your uptime with an inline fuel warmer. Reduce those annoying winter service calls, towing expenses, additional unnecessary parts, incomplete work and inconvenient breakdowns. To determine what fuel warmer is right for your application, visit philipsandtemro.com. Philips and Temro Industries, a century of expertise you can trust.